In mathematics, homotopy groups are used in algebraic topology to classify topological spaces. The first and simplest homotopy group is the fundamental group, which records information about loops in S space. Intuitively, homotopy groups record information about the basic shape, or holes, of a topological space. To define the NTH homotopy group, the base point preserving maps from an n-dimensional sphere into a given space are collected into equivalence classes, called homotopy classes. Two mappings are homotopic if one can be continuously deformed into the other. These homotopy classes form a group, called the NTH homotopy group pi n, of the given space X with base point. Topological spaces with differing homotopy groups are never equivalent, but the converse is not true. The notion of homotopy of paths was introduced by Camille Jordan. Introduction In modern mathematics it is common to study a category by associating to every object of this category a simpler object that still retains a sufficient amount of information about the object in question. Homotopy groups are such a way of associating groups to topological spaces. That link between topology and groups lets mathematicians apply insights from group theory to topology. For example, if two topological objects have different homotopy groups, they can't have the same topological structure, a fact that may be difficult to prove using only topological means. For example, the torus is different from the sphere. The torus has a hole, the sphere doesn't. However, since continuity only deals with the local structure, it can be difficult to formally define the obvious global difference. The homotopy groups, however, carry information about the global structure. As for the example, the first homotopy group of the torus T is pi 1 equals Z2, because the universal cover of the torus is the complex plane C, mapping to the torus Tc, Z2. Here the quotient is in the category of topological spaces, rather than groups or rings. On the other hand the sphere S2 satisfies pi 1 equals 0, because every loop can be contracted to a constant map. Hence the torus is not homeomorphic to the sphere. Definition In the n-sphere Sn we choose a base point A. For a space X with base point B, we define pi n to be the set of homotopy classes of maps F. Snx that map the base point A to the base point B. In particular, the equivalence classes are given by homotopies that are constant on the base point of the sphere. Equivalently, we can define pi n to be the group of homotopy classes of maps G. 0, 1, nx from the n cube to x that take the boundary of the n cube to b. For n1, the homotopy classes form a group. To define the group operation, recall that in the fundamental group, the product fg of two loops f and g is defined by setting the idea of composition in the fundamental group as that of traveling the first path and the second in succession or, equivalently, setting their two domains together. The concept of composition that we want for the NTH homotopy group is the same, except that now the domains that we stick together are cubes, and we must glue them along a face. We therefore define the sum of maps F, G, 0, 1, Nx by the formula equals F for T1 in 0, 1 half, and equals G for T1 in 1 half, 1. For the corresponding definition in terms of spheres, define the sum F plus G of maps F, G, Snx to be psi composed with H, where psi is the map from Sn to the wedge sum of two n spheres that collapses the equator and H is the map from the wedge sum of two n spheres to X. That is defined to be f on the first sphere and g on the second. If n2, then pi n is abelian. Further, similar to the fundamental group for a path connected space any two base point choices gives rise to isomorphic pi n. It is tempting to try to simplify the definition of homotopy groups by omitting the base points. But this does not usually work for spaces that are not simply connected, even for path connected spaces. 
the set of homotopy classes of maps from a sphere to a path connected space is not the homotopy group, but is essentially the set of orbits of the fundamental group on the homotopy group and in general has no natural group structure. A way out of these difficulties has been found by defining higher homotopy groupoids of filtered spaces and of n-cubes of spaces. These are related to relative homotopy groups and to anadic homotopy groups respectively. A higher homotopy van Kampen theorem then enables one to derive some new information on homotopy groups and even on homotopy types. For more background and references, see Higher Dimensional Group Theory and the references below. Long exact sequence of a fibration. Let P E B be a base point preserving ser fibration with fiber F that is, a map possessing the homotopy lifting property with respect to CW complexes. Suppose that B is path connected, then there is a long exact sequence of homotopy groups. Pi n pi n pi n pi n minus 1, pi 0 0. Here the maps involving pi 0 are not group homomorphisms because the pi 0 are not groups, but they are exact in the sense that the image equals the kernel. Example, the hop vibration. Let B equal S2 and E equal S3. Let P be the hop vibration, which has fiber S1. From the long exact sequence pi n pi n pi n pi n minus 1 and the fact that pi n e equals 0 for n2, we find that pi n equals pi n for n3. In particular, pi 3 equals pi 3 equals z. In the case of a cover space, when the fiber is discrete, we have that pi n is isomorphic to pi n for all n greater than 1. That pi n embeds injectively into pi n for all positive n and that the subgroup of pi 1 that corresponds to the embedding of pi 1 has cosets in bijection with the elements of the fiber. Methods of calculation Calculation of homotopy groups is in general much more difficult than some of the other homotopy invariants learned in algebraic topology. Unlike the seifert van Kampen theorem for the fundamental group and the excision theorem for singular homology and cohomology, there is no simple known way to calculate the homotopy groups of a space by breaking it up into smaller spaces. However, methods developed in the 1980s involving a van Kampen type theorem for higher homotopy groupoids have allowed new calculations on homotopy types and so on homotopy groups. See for a sample result the 2008 paper by Ellis and Mikhail Love listed below. For some spaces, such as Tori, all higher homotopy groups are trivial. These are the so-called aspherical spaces. However, despite intense research in calculating the homotopy groups of spheres, even in two dimensions a complete list is not known. To calculate even the fourth homotopy group of S2 one needs much more advanced techniques than the definitions might suggest. In particular the SER spectral sequence was constructed for just this purpose. Certain homotopy groups of n-connected spaces can be calculated by comparison with homology groups via the Hurevich theorem, a list of methods for calculating homotopy groups. The long exact sequence of homotopy groups of a fibration, Hurevich theorem, which has several versions. Blaker's Massey theorem, also known as excision for homotopy groups. Freud and Tulse suspension theorem, a corollary of excision for homotopy groups, relative homotopy groups. There are also relative homotopy groups by n for a pair, where a is a subspace of x. The elements of such a group are homotopy classes of base maps dnx which carry the boundary sn-1 into a. Two maps F, G are called homotopic relative to A if they are homotopic by a base point preserving homotopy F, dn times 0, 1, x such that, for each P in Sn minus 1 and T in 0, 1, the element F is in A. The ordinary homotopy groups are the special case in which A is the base point. 
These groups are abelian for n3 but for n equals 2 form the top group of a crossed module with bottom group pi1. There is a long exact sequence of relative homotopy groups. Related notions the homotopy groups are fundamental to homotopy theory, which in turn stimulated the development of model categories. It is possible to define abstract homotopy groups for simplicial sets.